Hello and welcome to Oceans Explain. This is just a short video on knife edge selection curves in fishery science. As you can see here, we've got a fairly generic cumulative sigmoidal shaped curve typical of any trawl fishery. And as I'm sure you know, all of the fish to the right of the curve have been retained by the trawl. All of the fish to the left of the curve have escaped. Using the example of the Barents Sea cod fishery, which has a minimum legal catch size of 44 centimetres, we know that all of the fish between the minimum legal catch size and the selection curve can be targeted sustainably by the fishery. However, for whatever reason, they have not been caught, leading to wasted income and wasted protein. Conversely, the area at the bottom of the curve here is composed of juvenile and undersized fish, which were not intentionally targeted by the fishery, however they have been caught. Therefore, fisheries management and fishers alike seek to minimise these two areas of the curve shown in red, with the overall intention of achieving a knife edge selection curve, where no undersized fish are caught and all fish that are caught are within the size limits. A knife edge selection curve is a theoretical ideal which we're working towards through greater understanding of fish behaviour, fish ecology and improving gear selectivity.